All right, guys, today I want you to ask yourselves how you respond to someone else's success. And the reason is the way that you respond to someone else's success tells you a lot about your own ability to succeed. Okay, how successful you are right now and how difficult it will be for you to succeed in the future. Because let's put it like this. There are basically two responses that you can have when you see someone doing very well. The first response is, hey, thank you. This is awesome. You actually accomplished this. That means I can accomplish this. That means I can actually believe that it's possible to accomplish this. So by you doing well, I understand that I can do the same thing, okay? For instance, you know, I've done a couple of transformations in my life. I mean, I went, you know, in like not even four months, I lost 40 pounds of fat, got ripped, okay? You know, and I was 39 and three quarters of a year old. I was, I turned 40 when I did my after pictures. So if somebody looks at that, they have the opportunity to say, Jesus, man, I could do the same thing. I'm 40, I'm 35, I'm 45, I can do the same thing. Right now, if I go ahead and I show you some of the transformations I've made since then, where I threw on, you know, 17 pounds of muscle in like, you know, a little bit over a year, some people are like, God, you got really strong, really quick. I can do the same thing. And that's the point to a lot of what I'm doing. I want to show that it is possible for you to do that so you can say, hey, I'm old too. I'm not a kid anymore, but if this guy can do that, I can do it. Now, the fact of the matter is, most of the people commenting on my videos, as soon as they see something, whether it's me or someone I'm talking about, whether it's a diet or something, all they talk about is steroids. They don't say, hey, that's great. They say, steroids, okay? And what they're really doing with their negativity is they're exposing the fact that they're jealous. And when they're showing their jealousy, what they're really doing is showing their weakness. Because the fact of the matter is, jealousy is for the weak. Okay, a strong man sees someone succeed and he either says, hey, good, that's not my path, but I'm glad you accomplished that. And he doesn't care that he didn't accomplish it because he's happy with what he has accomplished. Or he says, that is awesome. If you can do it, I can do it. And I'm going to do it now. And he goes ahead and attacks. But a weak person sees something and he's like, well, I don't know how to do that. I'm scared to go ahead and try to do that. And because of that, he gets jealous, he gets angry because he wishes he could do what you did, but he knows he can't or he knows he won't. I mean, let's say somebody makes a whole hell of a lot of money. Now, there are a couple different ways that you could react to this. So how are you going to respond? Are you gonna respond like, You made 72 grand in one month. Yeah. I tell you what, you show me a pay stuff for $72,000 on it, I quit my job right now and I work for you. Hey, Paulie, what's up? No, yeah, you know, everything's fine. Hey, listen, I quit. Now that is the way you're supposed to respond when you see somebody doing well, okay? You're supposed to say, hey, listen, you know, that is awesome. How did you do that? You're inspirational, man. I'm gonna figure this out. I'm gonna do the same thing because I want to achieve the same thing that you've achieved. Now, the problem is your attitude is what creates the rest of your life. Your attitude affects what you're doing in the present. What you're doing in the present affects your future. So if you are negative when you see something, that means you're not even gonna try, okay? Maybe if somebody's making a lot of money and you're thinking, well, I don't know what to do and I don't know if I'll be able to figure it out. And what if I figure it out and I try, but you know, it doesn't work and then I, you know, I look like a loser because I tried and I failed and it's a lot easier just to get pissed off and to not even try and that is fucking weak and that is why jealousy is for the weak. So from now on, Every single time that you see someone doing well, whether they got you know, a beautiful woman in their arms, they got a happy marriage, they got great kids, they have a big house, a lot of money, they're in excellent shape, they learn 10 languages, they do triple backflips, they can play the piano, they can speak 14 languages, whatever it is, 
If you see somebody that's doing something better than you, I want you to find out, first of all, are you happy for that person? Are you impressed? And second, if not, why? Because you need to fix that. The fact of the matter is, The Wolf of Wall Street, that little scene that I showed you in the diner, that's a true story. That literally did happen. And guess what? The guy who ended up working for Jordan Belfort got rich as all hell. And guess what? After everything that's happened to Jordan Belfort and everything that's happened with jail and everything, that guy is still doing well. He's still running a business. The same thing with Rich Piana. Love him or hate him, Rich Piana built an awesome brand. He had a bunch of awesome fans. He monetized this group of fans. He was making tons of money. He had an awesome life that he loved. And even he said, if he sees somebody with a Lamborghini, he's going to go up and ask him. He's like, hey, man, how did you get this? How are you doing so well? What is it that you're doing? You're, what are you investing in? What's your business? He would try to, even all the success that he has, he would try to find out what the person's doing. So that's the fact. You know, successful people are happy and use it for inspiration. Unsuccessful people are starting to have problems because, like I said, I know I can't do that. I'm not even going to try. And because of that, they get angry. So it's your choice if you want to get angry or if you want to get motivated. But I'm going to tell you one thing. Angry is going to make your life worse and motivated is going to bring your life up.